the 2nd of June 2018, Joe Canning of Galway watches his sideline cut during the Leinster GAA Hurling Senior Championship Round 4 match between Wexford and Galway at Innovate Wexford Park in Wexford. Photo by Ramsey Cardi, Sports Filet Galway moved a step closer to retaining their Leinster Championship crown, with Michael Donahue's side cruising to a 1-23-0-17 victory over a disappointing Wexford outfit. Galway opened the scoring in the opening minute courtesy of Connor Cooney's effort and the Tribes men had a dream start to the game with corner forward Connor Whalen finding the net after Padraig Mannion's initial effort was saved superbly by Wexford goalkeeper Mark Fanning, but Whalen made no mistake to give his side a four-point advantage. Cooney followed up with a score for Galway, before Rory O'Connor opened the Model County's account with a free in the seventh minute. Joe Canning and Pouty Foley traded scores, before Paul Morris's effort reduced the deficit to four points. Joe Canning responded for Galway with a point, with Canning absolutely outstanding throughout the course of the game. O'Connor replied for Wexford, before Cooney restored Galway's five-point advantage, with the Connacht outfit looking very strong in the opening half. Joe Canning added a wonderful sideline cut on the stroke of halftime, with Galway going into the interval with a 1-12-0-9 lead. Connor Whalen added a point straight after halftime, before Canning added another one of his trademark sideline cuts to stretch his side's advantage to 8 points. Three more points from Canning stretched his side's advantage to 10 points and at this stage the win was well and truly wrapped up. Rory O'Connor excelled for Davy Fitzgerald's charges throughout, but sadly he was one of the only Wexford players to perform, with various Slaney Siders anonymous throughout. Galway finished the game with 14 men, with Adrian Tui dismissed late on, but it mattered little, with Jason Flynn's 73rd minute point his side's final score of the game, as the tribesmen cruised to a 9-point victory. Scores for Galway, J. Canning 0-12, 8F, 2S, L, C. Whalen 1-2, C. Cooney 0-4, and Burke and D. Burke 0-2 each, J. Flynn 1F, 0-1. Scores for Wexford, R. O'Connor 0-12, 10F, P. Morris and A. Nolan 0-2 each, P. Foley 0-1, Galway, J. Scale, A. Tui, D. Burke, J. Hanbury, P. Mannion, G. McInerney, A. Hart, J. Cohen, D. Burke, C. Mannion, J. Canning, J. Cooney, C. Whalen, J. Glynn, C. Cooney. Subs, J. Flynn for J. Glynn, 54, and Burke for J. Cooney, 58, B. Concannon for C. Mannion, 66, S. Linen for Hanbury, 68, D. Glennon for Canning, 70. Wexford, M. Fanning, D. Rec, L. Ryan, S. Donahoe, P. Foley, M. O'Hanlon, D. O'Keefe, K. Foley, A. Nolan, L. Chen, S. Murphy, J. O'Connor, P. Morris, R. O'Connor, C. McDonald. Subs, Connor Furman for Donahue, H. T. L. Og McGovern for J. O'Connor, 48, H. Kyo for K. Foley, 51, Referee, J. Murphy, Limerick, Online Editors.